guys let me bless your evening with this beauty like i am saying a beautiful evening to you all with this cutie this girl is so sweet Ipeleng, you are too sweet i beg eh Oh, more your beauty, they carry me go where I know no. Sincerely, this is one of the finest housemates Big Brother Titan produced. Yes, go and tell them immediately Mimi said so. Ipeleng is one of the finest housemates that Big Brother Titan produced. She's so cute and so adorable. I'm not sure, even sure she knows how beautiful she is, okay? Meanwhile, Welcome to Sell With Me Shosti Mimi, where you get the gist as to the heart. So guys, hmm, they have caught our cozy, oh. like they have caught our cozy. Like cozy, they catch you red-handed, you don't have an excuse for this. But before we discuss about cozy eh, and what she did, let's talk about what happened earlier today. Hmm. Guys, earlier today in the morning, the social the social space was all about miracle OP, miracle OP. We love you. We did this. I was like, what is really happening? Why are they coming to love my boy now? Like say tomorrow, no day. Which kind of love it is? I know the miracle workers love him, but I know there are many people who never really liked miracle OP in the show because of how much he loved Kosi. Okay, so many people were now yearning, calling Miracle, I love you so much, this, that, that, until I dig in deep and I realize what happened. Hmm. You know, people have got to realize that even outside the house, Miracle OP never changed. Okay, he did not change from whom he was. They now notice that, oh, so all this were not game that this boy was playing. This is actually his person. And one of the things that exposed him more was Kanaga Jr.'s bevy. You remember, like, Few days ago, Kanaga Jr. celebrated his birthday all white party. Okay, so that all white party also did all nights too. So now he now get Kanaga Jr. posted this. Let's read it first before we continue. He said, "Hey fam, thank God it's Friday. Official theme for for a white affair. My birthday celebration will be dropping on my YouTube channel at exactly 10 a.m. So please, if you haven't subscribed to my channel, kindly do so. It's gonna be epic, guys." You already know E for extra. So guys, when Kanaga Jr. dropped this, I now realized that all the yearning for Miracle, all the love for Miracle was because of what they saw that he displayed on that particular always. You know, yes, when they did that always party, we actually posted a video. But we did not post the inner, inner, the deep, what really happened, you know, how everything played, okay? So now people have gone to watch it on Kanaga Jr. YouTube today and everybody is yearning. We love Miracle OP. We do this Miracle OP. I was like, oh, really? It is now you people remember to love my boy i mean when people were hating on him because of how much he loved course you people do not know even people that have seen talk down on him was loving miracle today cheesy actually call him out today but we are going to get there guys do not worry if you have not seen that kanaga jr all white party on his youtube kindly go straight there go and watch it you're going to enjoy every bit of it you got, in fact miracle op is the main show on that all white party i think miracle op is, a, is someone you can call and you'll be proud that yes you called someone even when he was giving kanaga jr um money it was all for meanwhile let's read all these some of the yearning so that people will not say i'm lying that people are, are hailing miracle op i'm just going gonna mention but few okay big nampa said guys i think mimi is the last born because i can't explain how annoying hilarious he is i absolutely adore him now he is such a spoiled brat a big baby even now you would see i actually he said i absolutely adore him now because definitely in the house they will be like mm, this boy is because his character miracle of peace character can be so annoying sometimes let's not let's not um argue on that one it's, it's true okay but right from the house i really loved that guy at a point i wanted kosi to give miracle a chance let me say my truth of her mother's spot said miracle no timing op is a case i love him so much so i am trying to let you guys know how he was raining how people were yearning for him calling him up on the social space today as of this morning as in i was like oh miracle they just remember you today kanaga junior all white party see what you made people do okay juma ola juma kenna said waiting mimi they always take that guy is too funny as in do you know even before as when i saw cheesy calling miracle out here yeah, i was like oh you did this so late because i have been when i see miracle opia all i reason is oh this is cheesy of big brother niger now cheesy now said 
They say that two head is better than one. So whoever that knows Miracle OP should tell him to hit me up. Guess we have list to compile. Before I forget, I am looking for Joycey. Actually, Joycey was one girl, um, Cheesy, attacked because the girl was talking of Cheesy now said her name is Odin Daisy. But that one, that one is for another day. Child. Let me talk, let me discuss the matter at hand. Now, Cheesy called out Miracle OP. I am sure he went to watch that vlog and see Miracle OP displayed <laughs> in that uh, Kanaga Juniors or White Party. So that was why he's like, no, 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 no. This is my mean second me. Let us do this shit. And if these two come together, Kasala go bust. Because in BB Titan, I was like, mm, this cheese, this Miracle OP is reminding me of Cheesy. Okay. And Miracle OP gets to reply this. He said, the combination of my head and your head explosion because people were actually calling miracle op up out that yeah come out though cheesy is calling you you know because even in the house if you watch even on some of my channels i'm always saying next next be brother um show that will be coming up anytime soon i want somebody like miracle op there because actually miracle op made bb titan fun if you would if you want to say the truth okay if you want to be sincere and remove any type of hate you would know he actually made it fun let's see some of the call outs okay before we get to discuss what he goes he did hmm lindo said guys please don't call me me him and cheesy can't be together yo i can't even imagine the drama these guys will create wahala hmm. okay um alabede rebecca said cheesy we really need miracle op on this especially we bbt fans aha uh -huh. i know you bbt fans need it so that he will sh miracle op will ship like cheesy did do you people saw the obvious ship in the house? Do you want them to start shipping? Already you guys know this is cruise from um Cheesy. But actually that cruise made the timeline so sweet and funny and also caused Bazboz as somebody was actually giving a name called <clears throat> I don't wanna say anything. So guys, yeah. So now people are now looking at that is why people were now all yearning for Miracle OP today. We love you, Miracle OP. And I was like, oh, you people are loving him now because of his display on your faves party, okay? T said, I am so looking forward to this. Miracle OP, Cheesy, they find you. Okay, Glory said, you and Liz. Cheesy, no shipping today. He actually did not ship today. If you did not watch the video on my channel where he was telling Fina that um, that he actually did that shipping because he was bored at, at work. There was no business coming up until when he started the shipping and business started coming up. King Kose the brand said the combo would, uh, would actually be bomb. Okay, Peaches said, official Cheesy, now the two of you together is a total mess. Real drama. The streets will cry. Meanwhile, we are waiting for it. I can't even wait to see the two of them together, even if not for anything, for them to be together. Now, let's enter the gist. Hmm. Guys, they've been attacking Kosi Twalao. What did she do? As you can see on the picture, who do you think Kosi was ho busy holding on that phone, admiring the person? You know, ever since Kosi started her um, media round, she's saying there is nothing like Yemi Tabank anymore, that she is doing her thing, you know. She's always saying it, even on her life, um, on her live um, videos, she's always saying it, that she do not have a thing with anybody again, that she is on her own, doing her thing, focusing on her, on how to make it happen, on how to be on the Forbes and how to do this and that. Guess what? Guys, just guess, you saw it already. Kosi was seen ho looking at Yemi's picture in one of the, her videos that I think, it, I think it was one of the video Marvin was making or something like that. But you can see hmm, she was admiring Yemi. Hold, you can see her hand is on hold on that picture. And people were like, oh, but you said you, were, you, know, you don't care anymore about these people. Now what is happening? They had to go and dig out the picture because people were doubting that it's a lie, it's not Yemi. They had to go and dig out, the, dig out this picture and say, see the picture and see the picture on that phone. What is the difference? It is actually Yemi, your cozy is admiring, as in it has been back and forth. I was like, hey, geez, as a celebrity, you can never be free because what is this? So, my guys, they were just attacking cozy that, oh, you said you do not like him anymore. What, leave him alone now. Why are you holding on his picture? Why are you admiring his picture? This one, that one, that one. I was like, oh, wait. Hey. In your very before, it go shock you guys when Kosi would come to Nigeria, she would be with Yemi and don't go surprised. So, better leave this housemate alone, leave Kosi alone. No, <laughs> so yeah, guys, hope you enjoyed this juicy gist as to the heart. And if you have gotten to the session of this video, I want to let you know that you are so special and Mimi Shosni Mimi love you. And with my full chest, I am signing off right now. I said bye, I love you.